Hello, my name is Nikolai Nansen. I am the great grandson of Fridtjof Nansen. And now we're about to enter his last home, Polhögda, or Polar Heights, as they would say it in English. What I know about Fridtjof Nansen, well, he was a great explorer, a great humanitarian, a politician, scientist, and a receiver of the Nobel Peace Prize. Fridtjof Nansen was appointed the first High Commissioner for Refugees in 1920. So now we are in the basement of Polhögda, where they have uh, created a little mini museum with some of his uh, artifacts. And here we have an example of an original Nansen passport. The Nansen passport was a certificate that uh, enabled more than 450,000 refugees and prisoners of war after the First World War to uh, find a new home or to resettle back in their original country. You can see from this particular passport and the stamps within it, it's been put to good use. And now we are in the most sacred room, his study. It's been kept in an original state, so it's pretty much the way he left it. I think he believed that the love of his fellow man and empathy was extremely important in his work as High Commissioner. And that's one of the biggest lessons I think we can take from Fritjof Nansen today. I think that one of his greatest legacies today is through the Nansen Refugee Award. It reflects his uh, beliefs and his hope for the future internationally, that uh, all nations stand shoulder to shoulder as brothers uh, to achieve uh, a loving, sustainable world for everyone.